LG is continuing to develop smartphone on Symbian platform. Today we are testing the KT610. You are on Cellulare Magazine. I am Emilio Vignapiano. The form factor is really pretty of this new smartphone. It's very look like A90, but it's really a different type of phone. It's not so business as the communicator is, so everything has developed in a different way. So as this is not a comparison, we just go through the phone. Let's start with the external shape. The keys are big and very easy to, to press, no problem. Everything working pretty fine. You can write very fast SMS with the T9. You can also make your phone calls and everything you need. In fact, in the outside memory, in the outside menu, you just have the application like contacts, new message, message in general, music, and camera. This is a very nice feature also, the camera and the log of the calls. In fact, when you squeeze the camera, you can see what is out there. Also, the numbers are very big. There is a speaker inside. This is just a shape uh, made of metal. Metal also in the front cover, all around. When you open, you have the bigger screen that is 2.4 inch. The outside one is just 1.45 inch. The resolution side is classical 320 by 240. Um, on the two side, you have speakers that works really, really good. In fact, let's taste them with audio. The sound is very high and there is no distortion, everything you can hear very very nicely. As you see, inside the menu you have Symbian and is the third edition, not the feature pack one unfortunately, but is uh, working very fast, everything is well optimized in this phone. This phone comes with three, so the menus are branded by the UMTS mobile operator. This phone has a complete QWERTY. As you can see, there are different lines and the keys are big. You can squeeze them very fast. Unfortunately, the right thumb has to move very far away from the, from the hand. So sometimes it's not very useful to squeeze the Y or the O with the right one. But if you need the joypad, here was the only solution. Also, these two keys on the top are not very useful. You, you expect them to be on the right side. In fact, sometimes you just press on the left and right side to move them. This phone is a 3-band with US UMTS HSDPA connection. To do a video call, you have to turn on to open the phone. There is a VGA camera. There is also another camera on the back that is a 2 megapixel camera just working nicely. You don't expect anything with this camera because there is even no LED flash. Just a mirror for auto shooting. The battery gives you more than one day of life, so this is very good. It's less than 1000 million pair, 950. And uh, on the body of the phone, you have the balance of the volume in this position to be used when the phone is closed. In fact, when the phone is open, you can use the five direction joypad for the volume features. Micro SD slot up to 4 gigabytes and then to charge and to sync the phone you have the LG connector unfortunately different like all the others LG microphone 
for a phone that is really dedicated to messaging. You have Bluetooth 2.0, no Wi-Fi, as this is branded in Italy with three, so operator asked to don't have any Wi-Fi. The dimensions are 108.9 per 53 per 70.2 millimeter. It's not so heavy, but it's 125 grams, so it's not even so light. All the features of Symbian are working pretty good. There is a really huge mistake to don't put Wi-Fi here, but with uh, three connections you can have also Skype, MSN, eBay, Google, all the series that all the application that comes with X series. That's all for Cellulare Magazine. Emilio Vignapiano with the KT six hundred and ten.